Hello everybody, I hope you're doing well. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to Dungeon Men's. Alright guys, so I took the time to take... <laughs> and so it was that Inca has continued on its lonely journey to become a true Dungeon Men's. So I went around the map and I, I found this little town over here. And I, they, they actually needed two Porloin inventories to, to be at maximum prosperity. And I had two Porloin inventories and I just gave it to them. I was like, here, you gotta take this. And uh, now what I want to do, I, I also went and I took the time to independently off camera go and, you know, get rid of my stuff and sell them and see if any of the shops around have any bows that I could take or any sort of armor that I could take. But no, nobody had anything, so I thought it would be a good idea to do that off camera so that you guys' uh, time is not wasted. And uh, I kind of want to go back to the dungeon that I fleed from. And see if I can finish it this time. Now, here's my only issue with this game, is that your items that you equip, uh, they don't freaking stay here. And it's really annoying. It's really, really annoying. Uh, where's my healing potion? Here it is. Um, door spikes. Very good. And also... What else do I need? Uh, stamina drought? Yeah, drought. Yes. Um, well, I actually did escape dungeon, so I know that I have it. And why not? I'll take the stamina thing. Well, what about iron wood? Yeah, these are like the in case of emergency kind of things that I need to have in my in my line of sight so I don't forget about it. Um, what else? Pinto wind's also really good. All right. Let's see, let's see what's up. Oh, hello. Goodbye. <laughs> Honestly, the Psychomancer is so incredibly powerful. Um, oh, I see. So this dungeon floor is actually explored right now. Oh. What about the secret doors? If I yeah. come across the secret doors again, um, I, I will take books from them. Hi. Take your book. That's it? What did I take? Oh, here it is. Oh, okay. Uh, what about this one? Is this empty? Yeah, it's empty. Mm. I want to take this guy's stuff, too. He has a chest as well. Oh, man. Where? Oh, I see. Hi. Can I step here? Oh, god damn it. Um Where was he? Hi. Bye. Oh, it's over there. Yeah, I'll take that little bit of gold. I don't I'm not I'm not that rich. To be like, nah. Empty. Love's also empty. How can I get the chest, though? I don't know. Never mind. Oh, hello. Goodbye. Oh, hello. Goodbye. Ooh, bar skin. Oh, he's three potions. These potions are actually expensive. They're about 15 uh, silver pieces. So I'm pretty happy that I can get a few on the go. And down we go. Goodbye. Oh, wait. Wait. Hi. How can I get past you? Is there anything that can get past you to the other side? Um, no. Bye. Oof! Excuse you! What is this? Can I use it? No. Let's go. I'm pretty sure I took the book from here. Because I fought that dude. Oh, I can talk to him? You're kidding me. What? Interesting. Ah, uh, la la la, eat curse, curse gear. Carefully escape dungeon, that's actually pretty cheap too. Yeah, please. Apply the curse. Wait. If 
if I do this and eat the curse, because you become stronger in the process. Yes. I'll try that. I actually have a bunch of these, I think. I'm pretty sure I do. So, but you know what? I have the money. Let's buy one of each here. I just don't want to curse. Does it destroy the item? Eat curse? You consume the curse magic, which will damage you, but you... Oh no, it doesn't. Let's try this. I mean, we're kind of in a safe spot-ish. Inkai's battle chaps glow with dark energy. Whoops. So, what do they do now? Oh, I see. Now, can I eat this curse? Please tell me it's not gonna like kill me or anything. Okay. Consumes a curse, infesting his inventory, and takes three damage. Okay. Did it make me stronger? I'm not even sure. Let's try it again. So, we are 75, 73. Let's see. 75, 73. Curse gear. Eat curse. No, not really. I don't know what it increases. I don't I really don't know. Um am I stronger? Who knows? We'll see. I mean I don't think we're even gonna see because I I'm already so strong. Can't tell the difference. Uh, did I take your stuff, guy? Uh, nothing there. Anything here? Nope. Do you talk to me? You do, you do. No, you don't talk to me. Okay. Oh, well, hello. Secret thing. Where? What? Excuse me. Aha! What have I done? This guy's gonna be a piece of cake, I'm pretty sure. Let's test his strength. Actually, no, you know what? Let's float some weapons. Oh, man, we don't have any. Um, we have the archer's focus, we just use that. Let's, uh, jump away, I can reposition. Have a dodge bonus. He's kinda tough. I'll take the bark skin. And, uh, I don't mind doing the jumpy jumpy. If it's going to be adjacent to the wall. Three blocks away. There we go. Ooh, found a ring and the proof of strength. Perfect. This ring is... And I picked up 86 silver. And 80 copper. That is insane. Uh, okay. <clears throat> Let's see. Mysterious ring. Where's my scroll of identify on Mysterious ring? And it happens to be a battler's bangle. Excuse me? Deal 10% extra melee damage, negative 10% range damage, ignore 10% of incoming melee. Oh, this is kind of like a, a watered down version of the, the ring that I had before. Um, I'll keep it for selling, and I'll lock it up so nobody can, or it, it doesn't, I mean, I don't know if anything's gonna happen to it, but I'll lock it. Uh, nope. Do you have a store I can, nope. Anything else over here? No, we should just go down. There's a ton of experience over here if I get all these monsters, but let's let's use the head to the nearest downstairs. Boom. How efficient. So I think this is the floor that things get a little hairy. But I'm not a furry. I have the deep roll to thunder focus. Um, gonna be very cautious. This guy's kinda tough, actually. I mean, with the damage that I deal with the bow is one thing. And the damage that I do with my punches, that's a totally other thing. It's completely insane. Uh, nope, can't real, can't use the real armor. Um, God, so many doors. Ooh, hello. Hello. I'm excited, but at the same time, I'm, I'm heartbroken. 
couldn't they be keep just I just need a better bow man. I just need one better freaking bow. Who are you? Your adventures unhurt. You're just a bandit. You're a nobody. Yeah, also I have like an insane amount of dodge. What's my dodge? It's <laughs> 97. That's, that's pretty good. I also have a good parry percentage. Sixteen percent of the time, I can I can dodge attacks. That's incredible. All right, what else? This looks like a trap or a secret, but it's not. <laughs> so this was a total dead end. I ooh. Sub B. Ooh. Oh, another mysterious ring. What is this? The Redoubt Rod. Ornate Captain's Buckler. Dungeon Crowbar, plus one, Inagi Okazu? What? Well, I can't use this. It's a pole arm. That does surprisingly increase damage range, but like almost shit melee. This ring could be useful. Um, where's my identify? Doom? What is this? I should check this one too. In fact. So, oh, Battler's Mangle again. We get this shitty ring. I'll uh, lock this one up as well. And... I mean... Should I use it? No. And honestly, with my 11 scrolls, I can, I can afford seeing what this is. Potion of Science. Increases science by six for about 20 rounds, it's worth 35 gold pieces. Outrageous. That's outrageous. And science is a thing that gives me, yeah, resistance to curses, bleed, poison, and other lasting offensive effects. Re elemental resistance, potency of my potions, and curses. Oh yeah. Um, uh, well, I mean, it's fine. Where are we? Ah, I see. Okay. Oh! I see you. Do you really want to do this? I can totally heal you. Ooh, what is this nice little war reaver? Jesus. I wish I could use it. One-handed axe. 2d8 plus one. Holy shit. But look at my strength. I'm doing 5d6 plus 10. Meaning my unarm attack deals at the very least can deal 15 damage. <laughs> that is just outrageous. I don't even know what to say about that. Except that I kind of want to close that door before anybody, all those monsters get through here. Fuck you. That's right. I level up. I'm a level 5 Psychomancer now, and let's put this, this doors back here. Oh shit, I meant to grab the... Fuck it. We'll put one over here. We'll come back to it. Yeah, let's just find out what's going on on this side. Hello! Uh oh Who are you? I... I, I want to level up before I do anything to you. I actually want to take a look over... Let's see, field work. What did I have again? Grants the way home. Gain the ability to return to the academy. The academy instantly from anywhere in the overworld. Okay, not the underworld. Increases dungeon sense. Your ability to sense hidden objects and dangerous situations is enhanced. Building on top of knowledge gained at the academy. Like, yep, that. Take that. Um. Can I? Oh, sweet. Oh, this guy's a uh, nobody. You freaked out about nothing. Oh, Piker Hoy. Hi, Oi now. Time to get your tea cozy black in the spots and whiskers uh, go. What? I do have some tea. What the hell are you talking about? 
Go get a refund from whoever sold you all those vowels. <laughs> okay, um, obviously we are going to take this. Can I toss you that you? Are you are you in range? You're not. Yeah, damn it. All right, I'll uh, attack this stupid guy. I'll see how much damage I can just do to you. You're level three. Hi, <laughs> oi, mate. You what now? Oh, he's he's a piece of cake. What is this shit? Actually, I want these guys to get closer to me so I can mess them up. What are you doing? What do you what do you think you're doing, dude? Another great victory for the Academy and all Dungeon Men's. You should be proud! I'm gonna pick up whatever that cut rate trash mob dropped. Yeah, hell yes. How much money? Ah, seven. It's fine. Scroll of uh, boot barter. Oh, is that the thing that changes my boots into like other boots? Where's my boot? Right. Scroll of. Yeah. Yeah, that's the one. Okay. Oh, awesome. More proof of strength. A lot of things are stacked right now on top of each other, so there's plenty of treasure to be found here. Uh, this is a regular weapon that I can actually use for floaty floaty purposes. Uh, light armor can't use. I'm such a medium armor whore. And an, an extra 35 silver and this amazing splinter grip uh, chopper that we're gonna you keep for floating purposes, basically. Tier 1. What is that? Flex Mirror Cucurbit? Excuse me? Return us to the Academy Headmaster. He'll know what to do with it. Oh, the Handy Mirror lets you watch all seven sides of the Cucurbit bubble at once. Okay, what? I don't know what that reference is or anything. Combat tunics and boots, loafers, shoulders. What is this? Proof of strength and antidote? I just need to see if I can use any of this. I can't. Are you serious? Oh, look, something we can use. Let's see if it's going to be total shit. It is worth a lot. Where's my... Uh, yes. They are cool, burnt, decorative, cursed shoulders plus one. Wow. If they're not cool, I don't know what they are. Plus, you lose 20 fire defense, but gain 20 cold resist. Um... It's just extra armor and dodge right now, at the very least. Brittle dried leather, perfect for decorating yourself in brittle dried leather. <laughs> Wonder ball. There we go, that's just good. Anything else? Anything else? Nope. Alright. Let's see what this rest of this room has to offer. Oh, hello. You looked scary, kind of. Are you hiding? Oh shit, you're level 5. Oh man. Um, it, it was a good thing that you were hiding, actually. I need some floaties. Oh shit. I need... I need to take this bar skin. I then need to do a kick off the wall. And murder you. <laughs> Simply. Okay. Level 5 down. We got so much shit from that too. Alright, so I think it's it's gonna be a good idea to go up here. Because we have some things to kill over there. And I can actually door spike behind me. Well, not anymore. I can spike this one. Ooh. No, I don't need to spike it. I mean, I'm, I can comfortably... Or confidently, I should say. Just kill all the monsters that might come my way. Hello, sir. How are you doing? Madam, I should say. Oh, hello, madam. There's a bow over there, but it doesn't look like a very important kind of bow. Oh. Ow. Discount shortbow. Fuck you, discount shortbow. So much. 
Holy balls, dude. You murdered me. I need a lesser heating potion. That guy just... That little slimy thing? I can't believe that's it. like... It's incredible slime. What are you? Jesus. Um, yeah. What's going on in here? Nothing. Anything... What is this? Guild of Mollard. Guild of Mollard. Mollard. Mollard? Who knows? <laughs> it could be anything. Hello. You're easy. Easy. How did you die? Excuse me? It was suffering bloody wounds. It already had bloody wounds. The poor thing had bloody wounds. I don't know how. Well, I, I mean, I'm not, not poor thing. I take that back. Fuck the bees. That's it? Oh, that's it, guys. We made it to the end of this dungeon. Uh, let's use a portal. Let's go back. I want to sell... Oh, hello. I want to sell my stuff. And I want to see if I can actually buy some upgrade hammers and use the upgrade hammers on my bow instead of sitting around waiting for a better bow to use. Because bows are great. Bloop. Bloop. Fantastic. Another dungeon cleared. Is there a reason why I should go in here? Or is it going to let me... Nope. Clear it? Nope. It didn't find it too trivial, I don't think. Let's go back to the academy. Let's see. Let's see, Headmaster. Headmaster! Headmaster! Hi! Hello, Headmaster. Um, I actually want to just identify all my stuff first. Thanks. Hmm. Still gonna have that unlock. Um... Poison protection. Oh, that's worth a lot of money. Oh. Lock. Wait, are all scrolls that expensive? And I just don't know. No. Just those scrolls are ridiculously expensive. Or worth a lot, not expensive. Ironwood brew that I have just hanging there that I might have used accidentally. That's worth even more. Let's lock this up. It's not going to prevent me from using it, it's just when I see my inventory, I'm going to know which ones, which things are super important not to use right away if I see one. Oh, what else can I... Oh, yeah, okay. Alright, hey, what's up, dude? Check this out! I got some books in the library! Oh, sorry. I meant relics. A whole collection of monster knowledge. Sweet. Proof of strength. Thank you. Is that a cucurbit there? With one of those new flux mirrors, our last one. Oh, he's excited that it has one of those flux mirrors. Our last one bubbled over and stained the lab. Uh, Rubidoo. For we what? I just so many words that I've never heard of before. I'll get this to the alchemist right away. I guess I'll have some thanks. Well, it seems like we've got some new supplies for the alchemy lab. I thought you are gonna... This is kind of out of place. Sounds great. I have expanded the alchemy lab to level 3, the best it can possibly be. Congratulations, dudes. You've unlocked the grand chemistress sprite for future, dun future dungeon men in this academy. Oh, I unlocked a sprite, a new character thing. Future graduates can visit the alchemy lab to have potions up to tier 3 pre-identified. Also, there are bonus potions waiting for you in the academy watch out, yes? Yes. Yes. One day that's gonna be me. Let's get to spending. Um, five means definitely another one in the skill. And science is not gonna be worth it. No. Uh, potency of potions. I guess it is very low. Then again, it doesn't have to go up. I'm just gonna save my points for later. Thank you. Hey, Headmaster, guess what? Um, I'm just visiting. Bye. <laughs> oh, wait. Could there be books in here that I can read? The inventor of punching. 
Oh, get... You notice a book written in an unknown tongue. It looks like a murder mystery. Can I read it? Maybe I'll, I need I need some murder mystery in my life to be a better dungeon man. No, I need to talk to dude. Dude! Get out of my way. Ooh, fancy spancy. Um, hello. Oh, okay, guys, so checking out the alchemy laboratory. So you all know touching a certain order here. Blah, 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 blah. Um, oh, I'll have you know that we are standing in an excellent alchemy lab. Or you are standing in an excellent alchemy lab. Some top shelf technology here as well as uh, refurbished instruments of old. We're this close. We're this close to fully cat cataloging the 213 different flavors of water. That's right. It's real science. You just didn't know because the man wants to keep the other 173 flavors for himself. If I find the man, I'll crush him too. Hello. Wait. Yeah, burn it all, throw it in the fire, fuck it all, that's everything I have, just take all of it. Wait, did I do all of it? Make, oh shit, I should have done the one that can't be, um, mental tossed. Psycho tossed, <laughs> mental tossed. Um, do I have any gear left? No, I, I, I liquidified all of it, I should have just done the, the ones that he can't, he can't psycho toss. But, 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 but. Um, but, still, but. It's empty. Fuck. Just checking things. Oh, by the way, let's not forget to grab my stuff from that chest. Um, upgrade hammers. What can I take? Right now, these are the things that we have. 300, wait, I can't even afford this shit. Still too expensive. The tin steel ones are... Kind of doable, I guess. I can probably get a ton of tin steel if I put my back into it. I worked really hard. Anyway, let's check a look at this. Oh, I got information on that thing. These kind of change color as you get more information. I think they solidify into rock. It's like clay. Hi. Uh, oh, sorry. Sorry. The war chest overfloweth with rewards for your hard work! Sweet. What do I get? A big jug, jug of academy sauce? You're shitting me. I get five big jugs of academy sauce. Resource loss of health, mana, and stamina gradually over the next few rounds. Monsters will still will stop in awe as you chug the whole gallon at once. This is amazing. It's worth zero, though, so it's meant to be used. So I'm going to, uh this back put this in here I don't even know why I'm redoing really that because they're not gonna be here the next time I load the game but let's remember that I have this stuff <laughs> all right guys I'm gonna call it an episode here this was a very good episode I hope you enjoyed it I really liked it if you did like it too please leave a like subscribe and thank you for your time and attention I'll see you guys in the next episode bye